Hi everyone, Paul here. Welcome back to the channel where I make how-to videos for Mac tips, backend, Swift, Salesforce, and game development. In this video, we're going to learn how to format an external SSD drive like the T7 Shield on your Mac and learn the different format options. I recently purchased this rugged 2TB T7 Shield external SSD from Samsung. Links in the description below. As I'm constantly juggling this space on my 512GB uh, M1 MacBook Pro. Unreal Engine, the gaming engine I'm learning, takes up a lot of space and sometimes I could have multiple versions installed so I want to see if I could use an external drive to just run it from there. By default, the T7 Shield comes in XFAT format. So XFAT format is used mostly for Windows. So if your goal is to use the drive uh, between Windows and Mac, you could stick with the XFAT format. So let me show you the different file format from Apple. So from Apple, we have the APFS, which is the newest file system if you're using Mac OS 10.13 or later. Or if you want to use um, the older version to be compatible, you could use the Mac OS extended. So we're going to use the Apple AFS here, as this is the XFAT that's currently running. And the read write speed of this one is around 779 for write and 695 for read. So we're gonna see if the APFS is much faster. Cool. So to get started, just open the disk utility. You could go other applications, under utilities, and select disk utility. Alternatively, you could open up the spotlight and search for disk utility. So you'll be greeted with this one. So currently I have two drives connected. This is, I want to format the T-Shield. So I get an overview here saying this is XFAT. If I click on erase here, the format options is only showing me Mac OS and XFAT. It's not showing me the APFS. So to do that, you actually need to go to view and click on show all devices. And instead of selecting the the volume, select the device itself and click on erase now. Now you would have more options. So for the scheme, it would allow you to do master boot, Apple partition map or GUID partition map. Go select per, uh, GUID partition map and now you could select uh, APFS. So if you want to do password protection on your drive as well, similar to what the T7 Shield encryption software is doing, you could select encrypted. But you could go, you could do that later. You could encrypt it later if you want. So I'm going to select APFS here and give this a name of T7 Shield. Just keep it the same and then click on Erase. So warning, anything on your disk will be deleted. All right. So once that is done, let me drag it there. So this is the new T7 Shield. And you would see it's empty. And if I go to the format, it's now AVFS. So let's try running this on Blackmagic this time. Uh, so select drive T7 shield, yep, and start. So the write speed is a bit faster on the AVFS but a bit slower for the read but I'm happy with that. Now that is how you would format your drive. So there are a few more options here for the disk utility that you could do. So if you want to partition your drive, you could do that as well. So to partition your drive, you simply click plus volume here and would ask you for another partition. So I could say I want a backup partition and you could click on the size here and give it a size. So I can say one terabyte and the color is one terabyte and click OK. When I hit add, now I have two volumes in here. From the same drive, I have a T7 Shield, which I'm going to use for installing my apps and the other drive I'm going to use for backup. So, but if you want to remove that uh, additional backup, you could do that as well. You could click on here and say delete backup. And that would delete the backup and restart back to 
uh, the T7 shield. So that is how you would create and remove partition. So it's pretty fast. Um, um, just keep note that when you're doing those, uh, those are pretty destructive. If you want to take a backup, uh, do so in, a, in your hard drive and then figure out how you want to do the partition. Cool. So that's a tip. Hope you like this video. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Please subscribe to the channel. Cheers. Bye.